Tyler Harris was just 19 when he died. Vancouver police say the young man was shot to death at the doorway of his apartment. It happened shortly before midnight last August 29th in the 3500 block of Northeast 50th Court in Vancouver. He is the oldest out of his siblings, um, so they miss him very much. And it, it's been it's been difficult, but we we take it day by day. Tyler's mother, Melissa, says her oldest son had four younger siblings and Tyler was a gem. Very strong young man had his life ahead of him, had a wonderful life ahead of him. Very smart, very caring, very kind. Now he's gone and the case is unsolved. Maybe these newly released images from surveillance video will help. They are of two women and a man, investigators say, are seen in the video knocking on Harris's door. Then moments later, Harris is shot and the three people flee. Take a good look. Both women are wearing dark leggings, one with the red and white Fila logo on the side, the other wearing a dark hoodie with what appears to be Washington State Cougar logos. The man is wearing Nike shoes that are white and black on the front and orange and yellow on the back. Tyler's mother had to celebrate her son's birthday without him recently. Now she hopes the images and Crime Stoppers $2,500 reward offer gives family the gift of closure. We feel confident that uh, with that footage and with the help of social media, that we will be able to get that out more uh, so that everyone can see that. And hopefully someone knows or maybe the suspects themselves will come forward and do the right thing. It will bring an end to a lot of emotional pain, um, a lot of emotional pain and a lot of the the why, why. Tim Gordon, KGW News.